Hello, I'm Karis. I am the best when it comes to talking to the rest. We were going to do an animated sequence for the first half of this review, but it was too expensive. So instead, we're going to have a super fat guy with saggy moo moo tits as a Discord mod review this movie instead. The SpongeBob movie Sponge Out of Water. This is the second theatrical SpongeBob movie made by Steven Hillenberg and Paul Tibbet. This film came out on January 28, 2015 in Belgium and on February 6, 2015 in America. This film does something that has never really been done before. They combine three styles of animation, one being hand-drawn, the second being live-action, and third being CGI. Three really is a magic number! But what's the story of this film? After a pirate by the name of Burger Beard steals a magical book and steals the Krabby Patty formula, Plankton gets framed by it, causing Spongebob to help him, which leads Bikini Bottom to a dark path. Eventually, Spongebob and friends learn that the formula is on land and decide to go after it, and defeat the evil Burger Beard in order to get the formula back and restore order and balance to Bikini Bottom. Okay, I need a moment. Okay. I'm ready. What's the deal with all this magic stuff? A magic book? The last film was about clearing the name of our boss. What's the deal with all of this? Let me just look on the wiki here. Yeah, there's nothing. I do like animation because it looks bright and clean. However, I'm not really a big fan of the CGI designs. I get it takes some time for studios to adapt to CGI, but here's the thing. Disney's first fully CGI animated film was Chicken Little, and they had this character. Remember, lay low. The live action segment isn't anything exciting to write about either. I mean, there is a cool superhero fight sequence, and I did like Antonio Banderas as Burger Bear, even though he was barely in this and isn't really threatening. This will make you feel a little butter. That meant it butter! Oh no! He's gonna. MAKE OUR FOOD TASTE BETTER! I also like the character line deliveries, mainly from Mr. Krabs, Patrick, Plankton, as well as Spongebob. Not to mention, they are developing characters just like they did in the first movie. I also really love the comedic duo between Spongebob and Plankton, as well as teamwork being the driving focus of the moral lesson. Plus, I could understand why Bikini Bottom would become an apocalyptic end-of-the-world scenario, mainly because the film explains why the Krabby Patties are important to the world of Bikini Bottom. I heard they were better than sex, and I should know because I went to that one city in Palestine. And, not to mention, this film replaces the traditional live-action style that the first movie had established for that world, and it replaces it with CG animation that makes them look like lifeless puppets. Now, which puppet ass should my hand be in first? The humor is a hit and miss for me as well. I think I only laughed the majority of three times in this film. Some of the segments are unnecessary. If you edit them out, you won't really know a difference in the flow of the film. Not to mention, Bubbles the Dolphin. That sounds like a prison inmate. Come over here and kiss me on my hot mouth. The last thing I want to complain about is this film's runtime. The film is 1 hour and 32 minutes, yet for some reason, the film felt like it was dragging on for too long. Not to mention, we have the weirdest ending ever to a Nickelodeon Films movie. We end in a rap battle. Why am I talking to you? Don't even play it! We'll get a copyright strike! The Spongebob movie Sponge Out of Water is an okay film. It does have its problems, but I must say, it's not the worst film made by Nickelodeon Movies and Paramount Pictures. The humor is there and the character development is remarkable, especially on Spongebob and Plankton. However, the lack of a threat, terrible animation, and whatever this is... You're an inferior species! What could you know about taste? You get excited by a pile of trash on a plate! What did I say?! The Spongebob movie Sponge Out of Water gets a 7.5 out of 10 on a scale of 0 to 10, 0 being bad and 10 being glad. I'm KRS and PLEASE DON'T MAKE ME REVIEW SPONGE ON THE RUN! I'LL REVIEW ANYTHING ELSE! You sure about that? You sure about that? Sponge on the run it is. <laughs> I have been publicly humiliated for the last time.